captured our excitement, it captured our attention, it kind of brought the internet alive for most people. And that is what I think this current moment is doing in terms of artificial intelligence. Watsonx.ai for new foundation models, generative AI, and machine learning. Watsonx.data, a fast, flexible, and open next generation data store. And Watsonx.governance to enable AI workflows that are responsible, transparent, and explainable. Watsonx. Yeah, I think you know some of the things that you know you talked about even today, and then we just saw even things about when you think about quantum. We're going to have to be ready for some of the things that quantum can do, which is phenomenal. But we'll have to think about can it start to break the encryptions that are out there. So how do we think about being ready from that from a cyber perspective? Even the things that you talked about just now with the launch of Watson X, right? You know, this would be fantastic if we could look at ways that we can standardize code or look at the way the code is written or connect the network. If you think about the number of developers that we have within city, uh, how do we connect that network to make sure that they're operating in a most optimized and quality way? That predisposed us to an, a, a hybrid environment. And before you actually acquired Red Hat, we were a key customer. We chose Red Hat um, as our platform as a service, um, OpenShift, and we started implementing that in our private cloud. And that started in 2018. Fast forward, we were getting great results from that. We were seeing the speed of implementation. We were seeing ease of maintenance, scalability, portability, all of those things that go with the pass and very pleased with the relationship. Um, something called COVID hit our industry in 2020, um, re really um, put us in a bad way. And kudos to Ed again for having the foresight and the fortitude to launch one of our most transformative and ambitious programs, which was to move all of our distributed workloads to the public cloud. And we chose IBM as our global strategic partner to help with that. We codenamed uh, the program Zulu. Um, Zulu is now about 45% of the workloads moved, about 30% of our people. And again, we chose Rosa, which is um, Red Hat OpenShift on AWS as the container platform and it's given us great benefits.